Welcome back to the Full Stack Ninja channel. Today I'm going to be showing you the project which we're going to build using Streamlit and Plotly. So right off the bat, the features you have in this dashboard, you can choose to display the data set or not display it. And the data set that we have here is um, was gotten from Cargo. It just shows the stock prices, the open eye low close for different stocks across many years. That's what the data set is about. Of course, you can expand it. Nothing fancy here. It's a very large data set. You can choose to hide the data set so it doesn't show, which is great. Then other things. We focus mainly on this time series plot over here. That's, that was our main focus. And of course, we added you know, you could, we're using the multi-select widget, the multi-select widget in Streamlit. That's what we're using to select all these options. So if you take it out one by one, you know, the plot becomes, you know, it updates. We can also come here right now. We're showing Amazon information. You could um, select Apple or any other company within the data set. I think this is a fun little project just showing how Streamlit and Plotly can be merged together. So watch the next video and I'll walk you through how this dashboard was made in one video. What I'm trying to do now is I'm trying to take a data set, finish it in one video. Okay, so there'll be the first video which is the intro video and then the code walkthrough just to save everybody's time let me know if you have a data set that is interesting and you want me to make a video out of thank you very much and see you in the next video